<clears throat> what is up you guys it's moon must intuitive guidance 11 11 and i am back with another video so i couldn't figure out what i wanted to do the reading on so i just started shuffling off camera and what came out first was taurus so you could be a taurus or you could be dealing with a taurus okay this is a specific message for a specific group of people there has been somebody that was doing some kind of spell work okay and it had to do with sex this is sex magic this is fertility spells pregnancy spells okay we have somebody that was doing some kind of spells and some kind of potions okay don't worry we will clarify okay and we have woman at the bottom of the deck okay this could be somebody that you know for whoever is watching this, this could be your girlfriend. If you're a masculine, this could be a girlfriend. If you're a feminine, this could be somebody that you know. Okay, this is definitely mm, the tower. Yeah. There's been a tower moment. These spells have backfired. Somebody's sex spells have backfired really bad. Let's see. What, uh, what else do we have? What messages do we have regarding this message about sex magic, pregnancy spells? What is going on? Magnifying glass. Yeah, somebody's getting more info about something. Okay, this is all about documents, examining the fine print. These are important details that somebody wasn't paying attention to when they were doing these spells they did not pay attention to the fine print and now these spells are backfiring okay causing a huge tower moment yeah for this woman at the bottom of the deck okay i'm telling you could be a taurus could be dealing with the taurus or whoever put these spells you know they could have put spells on a taurus Okay, let's see. What other messages do you have, Spirit, regarding this message? What do I need to warn this person about? What are they needing to be warned about right now? What is going on when it comes to the sex magic? What is going on? What else do you have to add to this message, Spirit? What else do we have to add to this message? What else do we need to add to this message, Spirit? Mm. Ooh. Self-indulgence. Beliefs come true. And we have kisses. This was somebody that wanted to just receive more affection. They could have the shadow work there's some kind of shadow work somebody is not doing the shadow work it was like wanting to receive some kind of affection and willing to do whatever they had to do they did some kind of spell work falling in love someone did a spell for somebody to fall in love with them and some kind of fertility spell okay and there's going to be something that's coming out to light Okay, whatever has happened, things are coming out to light. Someone is finding out about these spells. Somebody has, their beliefs have created their reality. Okay, whatever they believed in, it's come true. This person, whatever these spells have been, it has come true. Okay, and this person could be self-indulging right now in sex. Okay, with rabbits here. Let's see. Can we get two more regarding this message and then we'll clarify? Let's get two more regarding this message and then we will clarify. Let's get two more regarding this message. Challenge. Ooh. Respond versus react. Someone is having to respond versus react. Something. It's like this person, this tower that's happening. Someone is having to learn how to respond, not react to this situation. Okay, they know. Whoever they put the spell on, this person knows. And now there has been some kind of test with challenge here. This is all about a test before you can level up. Like I said, somebody failed a test. Okay, they did not read, like I said, the fine print. Okay, we have um, camera at the bottom of the deck. Ooh. Hmm. 
Okay. So let's see what else we can find out about this message. And then we'll clarify. What do we have to add to this message? What do we have, Spirit, to add to this short little message about somebody's spells backfiring? Somebody's spells have backfired. Yeah, temptation will test you. I'm telling you, this person is being tempted. They're tempted to do some more. Okay, it could have worked. And this person is tempted to do some more black magic. Okay, and like I said, spirit is waiting to see what they do. Okay, this is some kind of test. Okay, psychic ability. Trust your intuition. You need to defend yourself. Dealings or relationships with an older woman. Oh, this is a lot. Yeah, heartache over what you no longer have. Somebody is feeling the heartache over what they no longer have. Okay, and they're... Ooh, they're being very tempted. Time to go out and have fun. Yeah. yeah. Somebody, <clears throat> somebody is having a lot of fun doing this. Okay. Like I said, this could be an older woman. Or this could have something to do with Ooh. December. Something could be happening in December. You could be meeting somebody. There's a stranger that you're going to be meeting. Something that could be very important. Okay, let's clarify these cards. Let's see if we can find out more about this situation. Okay, Spirit, tell me, what is this... Um, Queen of Wands. Why is the sex magic here? Why is rabbits here for this message? What can you tell me? Clarify rabbits. What is all of this about? Yeah, the Nine of Swords. Self-sabotage and nightmares. This person, whatever sex magic they've done, it has backfired and they are having nightmares now on what is coming back to them. All of this magic is coming back to them right now. Okay? It's causing a lot of conflict. Okay, there was a lot of competition. Okay, they, this person felt like there was competition and they had to do some kind of sex magic in order to keep this person around. Clarify Taurus. Why is Taurus here? Why is Taurus here? The Three of Cups. Okay, this is all about overindulging. Overindulging. Okay, and sex, basically. Wow. Wow, this person was using sex for against something. Yeah, with the devil here, there has been some kind of obsessed. Uh, this person is obsessed. They are obsessed with this person. Okay, they don't know what to do without this person. Clarify the spell work. Why is spell work here? Why is spell work here? The hanged man and it fell sideways. They've done some kind of spell work to confuse somebody. The hanged man in reverse, this is all about confusion. Okay, they were trying to make this person confused. Okay, we have a queen of cups in reverse here. This is some kind of narcissistic female energy. Okay, um, somebody has been released from some kind of trauma bond. Okay, somebody is finding something out. They're finding out that they've been under some kind of spell and now they're having to come to this person and out of a loving place and try not to overreact because like I said, something has backfired. Clarify this tower. Why is this tower here? Clarify this tower. Mm, yeah, the page of swords in reverse. This is stalking. Okay, this person has been, this is all about being a spy. This is about being a creepy little stalker. Somebody has been a very creepy, creepy little stalker. Clarify these finer details. What are they watching? Clarify these finer details that they did not see. Yeah, they did not read the fine print. What what was these fine print details that they did not see? Yeah, the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. That could have a special message for somebody. Let me see. And I have this book right here. It's got reversals in it. So we're going to see what the Knight of Pentacles is in reverse. So just bear with me. Your partner has given up on you and it's punched a hole in your world. Wow. Rather than viewing it as an end to your love life, think of it as temporarily stalled. So this person is not wanting to think that it's the end. They just feel like it's temporary stalled. Maybe they can get this back on track. This person, whoever, whoever did this spell... 
my throat chakra, whoever did this spell, it's this, it's like this person punched a hole in their heart. Okay, like I said, they did not read the finer details about my throat chakra. Clarify the shadow work. Why is shadow work done? Uh, Self-indulgence. What is this? Yeah, energy vampires. Wow. So this is all about someone wanting to put your flame out. Okay, this is sparks, fireworks. This is putting someone's flame out, taking all of their energy. Somebody is not wanting to do the shadow work. They do not want to lose this person's energy. This person's energy gives them what they need to survive. Okay, what are these beliefs that are coming true for this person? The page of wands and the six of cups in reverse. Somebody has been, look, this person was always, they did not want to have kids. Like I said, there could have been some kind of fertility magic. They tried, this person is scared of commitment and in order, this is like playboy, in order to keep this playboy, you know, from going anywhere. They have been dwelling in the past too. This is all about dwelling over some somebody that you thought. This is like a um, karmic soulmate connection. This could be some kind of karmic soulmate connection, okay? And um, what is this? Uh, why is kisses here? Yeah, the sex magic for unconditional love spells, falling in love spells. Clarify falling in love, these spells to make somebody confused. What is this about? What is this about? Ooh, the Nine of Cups in reverse. Somebody's wishes have gone unfulfilled. Whatever spell they did to try to get this person to unconditionally love them, that part never worked out. Okay, this person could have had kids with them. This person could have married them. But at the end of the day, this person still feels like this person just does not love them the way they wish they would. Okay, and whatever they're, they're not satisfied. Okay, this is satisfaction. This satis oh my, why can't I say that? satisfaction and wish fulfillment sorry about that you guys like i said somebody is um keeping a secret Shh. they're hoping that they that um nobody uh calls them out on whatever they've done they want to keep quiet about this okay what is this respond versus react mm -hmm. moving on someone is moving on getting out of this fucking chaos Okay, what was this challenge, this delay, this leveling up? Yup, temperance, balance, restoration, fire and water makes ice. Okay, finding balance. Passing a test. What is this temptation about that's going to test this person? Why is temptation will test you? Why is that here? What is this temptation that's going to be tested? Wow. Some kind of masculine energy. Like I said, they're being tempted to do more spells on this masculine energy. To tweak with his head a little bit more to see how much they can get out of him. Okay? Imprisonment spells. Okay? Keeping somebody trapped. Keeping someone imprisoned. Under their... um sp Under... Mm-hmm. This is all about some spells. This person has done a lot of spells. Whether it's with actual, like... I think it was with actual potions. I don't think this was just some kind of, um, you know, speaking something into existence. I think somebody actually was working with some elements. Okay, they did not read the finer details. Let's see. Clarify this older woman. Why is this older woman here? What well, can you tell me about this older woman? What other messages do you have to add on? What other messages? Yes, this older woman could be a Capricorn. The devil. This person, this older woman that you're dealing with, they are the devil. Whoever this is, whoever this is for. Okay, yep, the queen of cups in reverse. This narcissistic female energy uh, could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. What's going to be happening in December? Mm -hmm, the two of pentacles. Somebody was trying to juggle something and someone's being forced to make a decision, possibly about whatever this is, with this heartache here. Okay, somebody's spells have backfired. Yep. Let's see. What else can you tell me? <laughs> what else can we find out? Let's get one random message from the universe and then we'll close out this reading. This is just a little bit of warning for somebody that somebody's spells have backfired. I don't know who this is for. Like I said, this could be for you or somebody that you know. Okay. 
You need some effing yoga in your life. Ancient shit is cool. Okay, what the hell are you waiting for? Get that shit done. If you have been waiting for a sign, well, here it effing is. All right, you guys. Let's see what the karma is for this person. I'm curious. Let's see what the karma is for this person that we're reading on. What is the karma for whoever <clears throat> for whoever did these spells? For these spells that have backfired. Whoever did these spells, what is it? Ooh, as you did in the past. This is something, a fourth house, something that they did what they felt could make them feel secure. Whatever this was, it was to make them feel secure. Okay, this is all about many words being said. Being aware of something, mercury energy, communication. For something that somebody did in the past. This person is paying for something that they did in the past okay mm -hmm. jupiter energy mm -hmm. grow and expand learn or teach it's all about luck and expansion okay we have pisces you could be a pisces you could be dealing with the pisces this is all about something that has resulted from the indecision about something somebody was in they couldn't make a decision they couldn't figure out what they wanted okay let's get one more mm -hmm. the sun realized somebody needs to realize they're realizing something okay something is coming out to light like i said you could be a scorpio you could be dealing with a scorpio Okay, this is all about trying to control a situation. Somebody is still trying to control this situation. Okay, I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. Subscribe to the channel if you want more content like this. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.